today, but it's all good, man. Hope y'all feeling good. Hope everything is all right and it's going to be all right. We almost at the weekend, so let's go ahead and uh, get this thing where it's supposed to be. All right. Urban Therapy with Sun Sun 752 with this your daily, daily, the daily, the daily go get a mism number 1K29 for July 27, 2017, Thursday. Yeah, all right. So, look, this is what I want to talk to y'all about today. And I, I think this is kind of serious because it's something that's going on that probably many of y'all have t taken notice of, but probably haven't said anything and um yeah well we're here to uh shed some light on it today you know that's it's it's, it's got to go down today all right what i want to talk to y'all about today is people acting crazy versus being crazy you know we see a lot of this on social media people acting crazy taping a little you know videotaping their little crazy ridiculous stunts out here trying to impress people you know I mean really really like you know let me tell you something about real crazy people let me tell you something about really like authentically mentally ill people first of all they can't control it there's no turning it on and off you're not crazy for convenience you're not crazy just for the day or crazy just for the night or crazy just for the situation or crazy just because you've feel like being crazy today when people are, are seriously mentally ill there's nothing they can do about that they have to they have to be like that 24 hours a day and let me and, and another thing about people who are authentically mentally ill or crazy as we as we will refer to it in this exercise they really believe that they're normal 100 percent normal not just like playing around with their normality yeah I didn't say normalcy because that's not really a word that word was actually crafted by some president in the 1900s it's no the word is normality anyway anyway like I said when people are seriously crazy they can't turn it on at all hey how you feeling my man all right they can't turn it on at all it's with them 24 hours a day seven days a week 365 days a year so you know even though they probably would like to blend in with other people they really do think that they're blending in with other people because their mind tells them that they are 100 percent okay and that everybody else is just a little bit off like they really think that they figured out some things that other people haven't figured out and they ain't really like that now now you have these other people out here nowadays <laughs> They want to act crazy because that's the that's the cool thing to do nowadays to act crazy, you know. So I uh, like if my man if I found out that my man is cheating or if he don't return my text messages or something like that, or uh, you know, like I what what I'll do is I'll slash his tires, I'll bust out his windows, I'll spray paint his house, I'll 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 call him you know 370 times a day and and you know blow up his phone and and I'll I'll meet him at his job and get him fired and all that. That's acting crazy. Yeah, you might have a little bit of crazy in you because. It takes a lot of energy, a lot of mental energy to, to, you know, do that kind of foolishness. However, you ain't really crazy because, you know, when the, when the police and, and stuff get involved or, or when you have to go back and forth to court or somebody tell on you or whatever, or somebody strikes back at you violently, yeah, you start falling back and you start devising a, a better scheme. See, a crazy person can't do that. A crazy person just has to keep acting crazy no matter what because they're not aware of the danger that they are creating or that may be um, or may be um, coming to them you know, on social media on social media we have so many so many twisted values nowadays we have people running around here thinking that it's cool to act crazy because you know brothers out here think that crazy girls <laughs> crazy girls have are better in bed they're better sexually you know so they have like the best pussy and all of that kind of stuff that I'm dead serious you know that's that, that's what people are saying nowadays so yeah I don't know what it is it's something about the crazy girls you know what I mean but you know they might be crazy you might have to put up with a whole lot of foolishness but 
Yeah, but they got it going on when it comes to that freak shit. See, more and more foolishness. And once, once females found out about that kind of dumb shit, now they want to act crazy because they think that's going to upgrade, upgrade they, they <laughs> it's going to step up their sexual prowess or whatever. And that'll be the key to them keeping a man. The dumbest thing I ever heard, really. But on social media and, you know, stuff like that. Yeah, it's going down like that. And brothers, brothers do it too. You know, brothers do it too. They want to act the fool or whatever. You know, she'll respect me or whatever. She'll respect me as a real nigga. You know what I mean? If I act like a real nigga, see, I, you know. Well, let me tell you something. That dude ain't crazy. He ain't crazy because um, the real crazy ones are really back and forth to jail doing serious, serious, long numbers constantly. They really don't have the mental capacity to, to, to shake that off. Not only that, not only that, but a lot of them have, have grown up in such a way that they, that, yeah, you can see that the mental illness is there. And more than likely, they've had had a, a, a long history. Let me fix my eye, man. These allergies, ugh, ugh, okay. Yeah. They have a long-standing history of mental illness. They can't just turn that off. They wish they could. Nobody really want to be crazy. A lot of people just want to act crazy. We got to do better than that. Because it ain't really getting us nowhere. You know, we have a bunch of dysfunctional relationships. And we're raising our kids to, 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 to witness this ridiculousness. Is it putting any money in our pocket? No. Is it taking money out of our pocket? Yes. Why? Why is it taking money out of our pocket? Because we got to be running back and forth to court when we act crazy with the wrong people and they either hurt us or we hurt them or or we get locked up or it, it, there's a really big misunderstanding. Hey, how you feeling, my man? So it's like, it's like, what you gonna go, what you, what you gonna go to the, uh, go stand before the judge and tell him, <laughs> nah, uh, judge, I was only acting crazy or whatever, you know what I mean? I apologize. I throw myself on the mercy of the court. Man, shut up. We got to do better than that. My, that's the bottom line. We got to do better than what we're doing. So all that acting crazy, you ain't crazy. You're just a fool, you know? Bowing down to the peer pressure to act like something that you're not. That don't even make no sense. Let's get on the body here, man. All right. Good things happen to those who wait. Great things happen to those who grind. And any, 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 any anything can happen to those who go for this. So go hard, go for yours. And remember, real crazy people can't turn it off. They can't turn it off at all. You know? They wish they could turn it off. They wish they could recognize the fact that they are mentally ill. You, not you, not all you. You just acting like that so you can get some attention. And that's not crazy. Everybody need a little love and attention, you know what I'm saying? The Daily Go Get Emism show is every single day, 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Call in number 319-527-6199. Blogtalkradio.com forward slash sun 752. Peace. Hey, crazy.